Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, the Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today, you know, it's been a while since I've recorded a video. It's been a few months. Not real by my cho by choice. Honestly, if I if it was my choice, I'd be recording every single day, multiple times a day, just uploading as many videos as I could with all the time in the world, but Life happens, things come up, things happen, friends betray you, you know, the usual. Um, <laughs> um, so, things happen, and, you know, doesn't always go the way that you want it to, but it's fine. Um, originally, I was going to record this with music, and then I read this, and I was like, you know what, I, my videos, I don't have enough subscribers to actually gain any money anyways so this probably doesn't really matter actually it would um so never mind um but yeah we're gonna we're we're playing genome um uh, genome guardian sorry i'm a little i'm a little uh uh what's it what's it called it's a, a little rusty when it comes to recording videos, so please do be patient. Like I said, it's been a few months. Oh, that's what that bar was. It's overheating. Oh, okay. Fire rate plus uh, max health. Ooh. Yeah, I want that. Okay. Uh, where do I put this? Right there? Oh, okay. Oh, and then there's a shot. Okay, 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 okay. So it increased my fire rate? I think, maybe? Um, which actually might not be really that important, or even that good, mainly because of the, um... The uh, heat and stuff. The fact that you have to like cool down and everything. Uh, accuracy, speed, accuracy, range, shotgun, submachine gun. I. I don't feel like. Contains a DNA letter matching this mod's code. Oh. Interesting. Okay, so that only... That's only for shot... Okay, I'm learning. I'm learning how this game works. So I need a shotgun for this thing to work. Power-up. Okay, 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 yep. Okay, well, I would love to not have to shoot, but kind of dying slowly actually not slowly very very rapidly to buy it i don't have they're too expensive shoot there to trigger shoot shoot uh, okay i wish this thing would go away oh thank you hey listen to me oh my gosh yeah, these guys are getting way too big for my liking. Uh-oh. Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna put that there, I think. Oh, and now it's another... Ooh, cool. So now I have both a normal pistol, and a shotgun blast. That'd be nice. Like, yeah, now I don't even have to, like, shoot as often. Can produce an antidote for all three. Tr choose which mutation you'll endure. Micro damage, micro health. Let's see. I guess I'll go with that. I don't. I don't know. 
Um, pistol. But it loses its accuracy. Okay, but you get an extra, an extra projectile out of fires, which is pretty cool, I think. This is really nice. I, you know, I would love to for there to be, you know, music, but I'd rather not get copyright strike on my channel. So just have to suck it up. Okay, okay. But yeah, again, I do apologize for not really uploading much. Like I said, I, if that was my choice, I would upload a ton. But at least people know I'm still alive. So, I feel like that's a, that's a good thing. Oh my gosh. This game is very interesting. Shotgun, I could get another shotgun. Uh, add a weapon beside a weapon letter. ACGT. Um, uh, I don't... Oh, you, you pay to unlock those slots. Ah, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. I'm learning. Go away, you stupid thing. My gosh, that thing has so much health. There we go. Yeah, I'm I definitely would say more projectiles or more um weapons is probably the better way to go. I I don't have enough money. Click to dismiss. Okay. You know, when I'm clicking to dismiss, I wish it wouldn't, you know, fire the weapon as well. But, you know what? I guess it's fine. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm, I, I think I'm dead here. I think this is, yep. Yeah. Okay. So turn to setup. Okay. Defend yourself from hostile micros while you extract valuable research and biomaterials. Deeper depth and new modes in full game. Okay, cool. That's great. Heat. Remember the first hit you take each wave. Turret scale. So I can choose only this one. Okay. That's fine. And you can choose different weapons. Okay. Um, I feel like shotgun is probably better. Intro research. Oh, okay. You spend biomass to open slots. So I have t speed of your projectile, size of your projectiles. Um, max heat. Microbe health, and then you can unlock new stuff. Cool. Um, we'll probably upgrade that a little bit. We'll get more starting mass, and then we'll decrease the cost of the weapon slots and stuff. Okay, okay. It's a rogue light, which is cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Definitely need more range on the shotgun, because that is, that range is horrible. I know I chose the shotgun, but the spread is pretty bad as well, but it's a shotgun after all. I mean, what can you really, what can you do? Um, definitely don't want less range. That would not... Definitely would not be a good idea. Um, let's go with that. We probably do want something with longer range. Maybe the pistol, maybe the 
submachine gun. I should have paid attention to the range of the different weapons. That would have been smart, but how how am I shooting like a billion projectiles and enemies are still just dodging? Like yeah, we're just going to hold on to my biomass. I I really think that shotgun doesn't actually seem that good. Like, if you get the thing that increases its range, I feel like it is good. But at the start, it's pretty bad. Like, it's definitely good for, like, taking out bigger enemies after they get close to you. But taking on enemies just by themselves, I don't know. Shotgun with Titan spread or firing pellets more accurately with higher velocity consistently hits target medium range. Okay. Whoa. Okay, hunting shotgun. Yep, never mind. Shotgun is great. You just need to upgrade it to a hunting shotgun. Then it becomes insane. Still not the greatest of range, but dang, we just unlocked a whole new aspect of this game. What if I can bind two shotguns together? This is the part that I need. Knockback and size. Sure, why not? See what we'll see what happens. This, honestly, that might not be that good, knockback and size, just because you're knocking enemies back further away from where you can shoot when you already have kind of limited range. Like, you already have pretty short range, and then knocking enemies back, I don't know if that's such a good idea, but without stopping. Honestly, doesn't even seem that good or seem that bad. Uh, homing. Wait, can I move these? Dang it. But that seems insane. That seems so good. I wish I could get that on the hunting shotgun though, but I don't have enough. But I'll try to get him to like a hunting shotgun, like this guy here. Try to get him to, like, a hunting shotgun or something. See what we can get from that. Because home... I mean, I can't turn down homing projectiles. Come on. Literally takes out the whole point... A whole need of, like, aiming and stuff. Look at that guy. That guy just got launched. But see, that's what I mean by, I don't think it's such a good idea to have um, the knockback. Because it makes it so that, like, the round goes by and then... also makes it harder for projectiles to actually hit the target. Which is obviously not a good thing. Yeah, we'll turn that into a hunting shotgun. I have two hunting shotguns, one with um, homing projectiles, and the other one with major knockback. You know, this is a time when I could definitely use um, some faster firing. I didn't think it was really that necessary before. And now I really want it. We're going to go with that. I'm going to upgrade kind of like this top part. Kind of see what we can get from it. That was rude. That was very rude. Oh my gosh. See, the problem is, the knockback becomes good after you start getting super overwhelmed. 
that's the only time it becomes good. I wish, I really wish you could have music in this game. I wish it wasn't copyrighted. Because the music in this game is actually pretty nice. Oh my gosh. Dang. Yeah, I definitely could use a bit of a better setup. Okay, there we go. Now that's maxed out. We're gonna go with that stuff. So now it says, oh wait, oh, item cost. Oh wait, and I should get rid of... Yeah, I don't really... Yeah, I don't, I don't like the shotgun. I, I take it back. I think the shotgun's pretty bad. Um... The pistol has the longest range, which I feel like range is fairly important. So. Oh, okay. You can also shoot with left and right click and the space bar, which I should have paid attention to that before, but I didn't. As long as you can aim, you can basically shoot enemies from a very far distance without having to worry about them getting too close to you. I feel like is a good thing. <laughs> um, what does Sticky do? Per elimination, heat max. Per elimination. Ooh. Curious. So. Hmm. I think we're going to do that. And I think I'm going to get the submachine gun, honestly. Scout rifle. That seems cool. If I can actually aim. So yeah, I wonder, like, is there even a downside to just having, like, one weapon that just is, like, a combination of a bunch of different weapons? Because I feel like that seems like it could be really good. To just, like, combine all your weapons together, basically. Obviously, it gets pretty expensive. Um, but at the same time, I feel like it could be worth it. If you can get, like, an insanely good weapon. Just, with, like, one really good weapon. Then again... You get, so for example, you would get, um, I think it uses, does it use, so like if you have two weapons, right, two separate weapons, is it like bouncy ball? Wow. Whoa, that's so sick. Bounces off of enemies. That's awesome. And the range is crazy. Imagine homing on this thing. Oh my gosh. Does it have homing? No, it doesn't. Okay. Yeah, get the homing thing on this, and that would be crazy. Increase the range? Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Yeah, see, there we go. Oh. Hmm. Dang it. Well... Uh, I'd have to get the bomb thing, but... Ooh, okay, there we go. We got more range. Triple fire rate, oh my gosh. Doesn't seem like it really uses up much heat, but that might just be the triple fire rate thing, I'm not sure. Yeah, well, it's just the triple fire rate. Wait, is the... Maybe the more, the higher your fire rate, the less heat it uses. That's kind of what it seems like. Micros are extinct. Um, micro health. What if I go with with G with G DNA? I mean, does it? I don't know. I'm not, I, you know what? I don't, I don't know. 
Um, I could go with faster cooling rate, but I don't think that's really that good. Research rate times two. Ooh, nice. But yeah, I'm curious if the faster the fire rate, the less heat it produces. Because that kind of feels like how, how it works. But I could just be wrong. Typically, I am. The damage is really good on this thing, though. Whoa, that was a nice shot. Damage and less fire rate. It's sticky. What does that mean? What is... I don't know what sticky does. To buy them. There was like a guide thing before, and I probably should have paid attention to it. But, I don't know. We're not gonna we're not gonna mess with it. Cause I want homing and I need and I want more range. Cause I feel like the bouncy ball thing would be really good for like basically most circumstances. It's just you need the right mods for it. Cause it's got like good damage. Homing, there we go. It's like you could just have it basically like bouncing around and it's just like homing onto the targets. Okay, that might have been a bad idea. I don't regret that one bit, because that was really fun. Fire rate. Yeah. Go with that. Faster fire rate. I love these the bouncy ball. It's so cool. Look at that, and then with triple fire rate, and it's got homing, and it's, oh my gosh. Speed bomb. Should I get the bomb thing? I could. I don't know, I mean, I, I assume it sends out, you know, a bomb, but. What happens if you add it to the, ooh, maybe it'll be like an explosive bouncy bomb. Or explosive bouncy bouncy bomb bouncy ball. I want the explosive bouncy ball now. Okay, I'm not paying any attention to like where. Okay. <sighs> I should be paying attention. <laughs> cooling delay? I think less cool, or like, yeah, faster cooling delay would be better. Um, oh, and you can buy more perk slots as well. Cool, okay. We're gonna go with this. We're gonna have, we're gonna see how this goes. Okay. Should be should really pay attention. You know, paying attention is fairly important in this game. I mean, I'm no expert at this game, but usually paying attention is vital to most games. Other than idle games, I guess. But health after each wave survive without taking a hit. Um accuracy and speed. I'm going to re-roll. Accuracy, projectiles, less range. None of these are really that good. What's with the white? You know what? Let's just buy a pistol. I don't know what the white does, though. But now we have two pistols. Two pistol shots. So theoretically, enemies that do take... 
to pistol shots will now just die in one hit. I also want to increase the range. Ah, oh, that guy got knocked away. Uh, to weapons with... See, there we go. That's what we need. We needed more range and accuracy. Okay. So now any weapon that has the cDNA is going to be really strong. Or at least stronger than it was. So basically we kind of want to focus on more homing. Oh my gosh. Do I, okay, if I add, I get the one thing, right? And then this is the hunting shotgun. That's right. I think the hunting shotgun is probably better. I think it's less damage per projectile, but obviously it shoots out way more projectiles. And then you also get the extra range, extra accuracy. I feel like this is actually pretty a, a pretty strong start. Okay, yeah, nothing nothing really. What is what is the white? Is that just like it it can go for everything? I feel like that's probably what it is, right? Cuz like white usually symbolizes like all the colors and stuff. Cuz like the white like the color white is technically like a combination of all the colors and like the color black is obviously the void of color offspring size micro extinct speaking of DNA extinct babies that oh including projectiles you know what actually increased projectile size seems good Now we get homing on that fire, on that, on those projectiles. That guy had more health than I thought he would. But yeah, I'm thinking like if their babies are bigger, that'll make it easier for me to hit them, right? Am I wrong in thinking that? I mean, yes, it makes it so that it's easier for them to hit me, but am I really that worried? Bounce. Ooh. And it's increased range? Oh my gosh. Now the projectiles bounce. They are homing projectiles that bounce off the screen. And have incredibly long range. Now, if I can get the bouncy ball thing as well. Oh my gosh, that was cool though. Let's see. I must say, it is a little scary watching giant, um, giant stuff come my, like, giant projectiles come my direction, but. Oh my gosh, yeah, I'm. I'm I'm definitely hurting a bit. I probably should have bought that, but it's fine. Yeah, I'm hurting. Hurting a lot. Don't they have that commercial if you're hurting, just call Burton. You think Burton will help me right now? I'm not sure if they will. Gosh dang it. Okay. Um, 
I think is it is anything for your range? It doesn't seem like it. There's fire rate and d damage, size, speed, literally everything but range is here. Are you kidding me? Okay, well. We'll go with that. Let's see. So we have... Cooling delay while overheated. Yeah, honestly, I feel like that's just good. Can I get... Okay. I think we're going to do one more. We're going to do more, one more run, and we'll see how it goes. This will be my last run for today. That other run was pretty fun, I must say. I love the idea of just like projectiles just bouncing off the screen, like a, just getting a ton of projectiles that just bounce all over the place. Critical chance damage. What happens if you combine two pistols together? Sniper rifle. Uh. Well. I can I can see how it would. Yeah, that fire rate, though, is bad. What happens if you just have four pistols? Oh my gosh, that was actually such a good shot. It's got good damage. I, I, I mean, it's a sniper rifle. I would assume it has good damage. And it's got really good range as well, so... Yeah, what if I just have... I have a laser now? Well, oh, I was hoping I could hold it down, but it doesn't quite work that way. But it has infinite pierce, I assume? I'm going for a fourth pistol. I want to see what happens. So sick. I don't need more accuracy and speed for a laser. Come on now. You think I need more accuracy and laser or accuracy and speed for a laser? Literally has instant the speed is instantaneous. And the accuracy is as precise as you can get. Whoa, that was sick. It's a shot of instant ultimate dis with near perfect accuracy. Synergizes with Beth. Best with range reducing upgrades due to its excess base range. Oh. Yeah, so the range is going to be crazy. So anything that, like, reduces range is going to work best with this. Oh my gosh, get off of me. Get off of me. I can't hit this guy. Do without stopping. Yeah, sure. Look at that, why not? I could use the extra health. Could use more fire rate as well. That is cool though, that the laser kind of sticks around for a little bit. So enemies can kind of like can fly into it as well. What does homing do with an ion laser? Does it do anything? No? Didn't think so. Okay. 
I was curious though. I was curious if it would like curve. Oh, it does. Oh, it does. That is sick. Um, yeah, we're going to go with that. Ah, oh, that's so cool, though. That was sick. That was awesome. Oh, and then you could increase the... Oh, wait, the speed. Oh, the speed would probably be really good, actually. Oh, this game is so sick. Okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Genome Guardian. Again, I do apologize if at any point the audio or anything like that was a bit fuzzy or whatever the case may be. Um, Obviously, first time. Uh, back recording a video in however many months, two, three months by now at this point. But hopefully going to be able to get back. Obviously can't promise I will, but, you know, still going to, you know, keep, I'm going to keep the channel obviously around. And my videos are, you know, you guys are more than welcome to keep watching my videos and I'll keep trying to, uh, to upload as much as I can. Because I do miss you guys. I I love making videos. It really is like something that I'm just that I, I have always loved doing since the since like the first video that I posted on this channel. After that, I was like, you know what? I genuinely cannot get. I cannot wait to post more. And you know, I really really have missed doing that. So. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Genome Guardian. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. Mean the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. You guys take care.